In this video, I will discuss about Human Skeletal System A short description of all bones of the body and The functions of skeletal system The human skeletal system consists of all of the bones Cartilage Tendons And ligaments in the body the skeleton of an adult contains 206 bones. Skeletons of children actually contain more bones because some of them fuse together as they grow up, such as the bones of the skull. The skeletal system is divided into two parts, known as the axial skeleton and the appendicular skeleton. Axial skeleton anatomy the adult axial skeleton consists of 80 bones. It includes the bones of the head, neck, chest, and spine. The adult skull is comprised of 22 bones. These bones can be further classified into cranial and facial bones. There are 8 cranial bones. Ethmoid, sphenoid, frontal bone, Two parietal bones, two temporal bones, and occipital bone. There are 14 facial bones. They are found on the front of the skull and make up the face. Facial bones include two nasal bones, two lacrimal bones, two inferior nasal conker, two maxilla. 1 mandible, 2 palatine bones, 2 zygomatic bones and 1 warmer bone. Auditory ossicles. The auditory ossicles are 6 small bones found within the inner ear canal in the skull. These bones include malleus, incus and stepes. They work together to transmit sound waves from the surrounding environment to the structures of the inner ear. Hyoid. The hyoid is a U-shaped bone found at the base of the jaw. It serves as a point of attachment for muscles and ligaments in the neck. Vertebral column. The vertebral column is made up of 26 bones. The first 24 are all vertebrae followed by the sacrum and coccyx tailbone cervical vertebrae these seven bones are found in the head and neck thoracic vertebrae these 12 bones are found in the upper back lumbar vertebrae these five bones are found in the lower back the sacrum and coccyx are both made up of several fused vertebrae they help support the weight of the body while sitting. They also serve as attachment points for various ligaments. Thoracic cage. The thoracic cage is made up of the sternum, breastbone and 12 pairs of ribs. The sternum or breastbone is a flat bone located at the anterior aspect of the thorax. It lies in the midline of the chest and has T-shape. In humans there are normally 12 pairs of ribs. The first 7 pairs are attached directly to the sternum by costal cartilages and are called true ribs. The 8th, 9th and 10th pairs are called as false ribs and do not join the sternum. These bones form a protective cage around the organs of the upper torso, including the heart and lungs. Appendicular skeleton anatomy. There are a total of 126 bones in the appendicular skeleton. Pectoral girdle. The pectoral girdle is where the arms attach to the axial skeleton. It is made up of the clavicle, collarbone, and scapular shoulder blade. Scapula connects the humerus upper arm bone with the clavicle collar bone. The scapula is a flat, triangular-shaped bone. A pair of scapula is present in human skeleton. The clavicle is the bone that connects the sternum to the shoulder. 
It is a very solid bone that has a slightest shape and it is also called as beauty bone. In humans, a pair of clavicle bone is present. Upper limbs. Each arm contains 30 bones. Humerus. The humerus is the long bone of the upper arm. Radius. The radius is one of two long bones of the forearm. Found on the thumb side. Ulna. The ulna is the second long bone of the forearm. Found on the little finger side. Carpals. The carpals are a group of eight bones found in the wrist area. The names of carpal bones are scaphoid, lunate, trichoetral, pisiform, trapezium, trapezoid, capitate, and hamet. Metacarpals. The metacarpals are five bones found in the middle area of the hand. Phalanges. The phalanges are 14 bones that make up the fingers. Pelvic girdle. The pelvic girdle, commonly known as the hips, is where the legs attach to the axial skeleton. It is made up of two hip bones, one for each leg. Each hip bone consists of three parts, known as the ilium, ischium, and pubis. Lower limbs. Each leg is composed of 30 bones. Femur. The femur is the only bone in the thigh and the longest bone in the body. Tibia. The tibia is the main bone of the lower leg. It forms the shin. The tibia is the second largest bone in the body and it is a key weight bearing structure. Fibula. The fibula is the second bone in the lower leg, found on the outer side of the leg. Patella. The patella is also called as kneecap. It is a small bone located in front of the knee joint. Tarsals. The tarsals are the seven bones that make up the ankle. The names of tarsal bones are cuboid, lateral cuneiform, intermediate cuneiform, medial cuneiform, navicular, talus, and calcaneus. Metatarsal the metatarsals are the five bones that make up the middle area of the foot. Phalanges. The phalanges are 14 bones that comprise the toes. Functions of the skeletal system. The function of the skeletal system is to provide support for the body. Protecting internal organs from injury. Allows the body to move in different directions. Producing blood cells. Storing minerals and nutrients. Subscribe my YouTube channel and press the bell icon. Like, comment, and share.